Hello, welcome to PR Media Channel. This is Resu. Do you know how many products you can make by blow molding process? Or what are the advantages of blow molding? Let's figure it out together. First of all, let's get to know what is blow molding. In blow molding, hollow plastic components are formed through a producing process categorized into three main methods injection, extrusion, and injection stretch blow molding. The extrusion blow molding essentially starts with the melting down the plastics and rolling it immediately after being removed from the furnace to form it into a person. Its final form is a tube-like plastic that has a hole in one end that serves as a passageway for compressed air, which blows the plastic material in the mold to shape it. The name also comes from here, blow molding. Once it has cooled down and hardened, the mold would open and uh, eject the part. On the other hand, in the case of injection and injection stretch blow molding, these processes use a preform, a piece that already has a form beforehand in injection molding machines, such as this one is 5 gallon PT bottles preform, which made in injection molding machine. And after that, in blow molding machine, it turned into this. Since blow molded products are everywhere in our daily life and those are really common, so let's talk about the advantage of blow molding process. First of all, blow molding provides a huge variety of applications. Since blow molding allows a freedom for design and engineering, the range of applications that you can manufacture by blow molding is really wide. Most of plastic containers on the market that hold some forms of liquid that are made by blow molding process. And there are several industries that uh, mostly use blow molded products such as automotive industry, appliance components, medical supplies, children's toys, packaging, and sport goods are only some examples of this. Blow molding process provides a low cost production. Especially extrusion blow molding uses a lower level of pressure. This means that machinery costs are low. It will become easier and more cost efficient to open the mold after the blowing process. Blow molding allows multiple production methods. Blow molding uses different methods to create final products. While the extrusion method roughly works like traditional glass blowing, the injection method has a slightly different process. Instead of using preform, melted polymers are injected into the blow mold. This technology keeps on developing to improve the production methods and allows a great design flexibility. It helps to promote productivity. Blow molding technology always moves forward to become a universally plastic production method. It has allowed a significant increase in production capabilities, then manufacturers can produce greater quantities in just a short period of time. Blow molding offers benefits of automation. Blow molding process is a very suitable method for automation, especially using the robot technology for takeout units and packaging offers a great benefit of faster production. Besides that, you can also reduce the labor cost by using automation. Thank you for your time. If you liked the video about blow molding, remember to like the video and follow the channel. See you in the next episode.